Hello, my friends. Today, I'm going to raise the worst child possible in The Sims 4. This child is going to end up with every negative trait that I know exists. I am typically very anal about the way that I raise my children, so I've never had a sim with any negative reward traits. So I'm very excited to do the worst possible job raising a parent today with you in The Sims. Let's get into it. <laughs> So this is my sim here. Her name is Toni Collette, named after, yes, her. I am your mother. And this is her daughter here, Tiny Collette. <laughs> Tony Collette and Tiny Collette. Now, Tony is lazy, mean, and she hates children. She's also a freelance artist, and she's just really focused on her career right now. She just doesn't have a lot of time to take care of Tiny here. And we have Tiny, who is, of course, intense and sobbing on the floor, hungry, and why is she even on the floor? I didn't even ask Tony to put her on the floor. She could have come in and put her on the crib, but no, she left her on the floor. So Tony's the kind of parent she is all on her own. We're on short lifespan here, so Tiny's only going to be an infant for three days and we're just gonna do everything in our power to make sure that that we do not take care of her we're not gonna let her starve because we don't want her to get taken away we're just really busy right now and baby is a lot it's a lot to take care of she's tense from her crying baby how long should i leave her here i'm gonna let her get a little more hungry i'm gonna feed myself oh yeah i could have let her put tiny in the crib oh she's gonna put her in the play mat okay <laughs> not the crib the play mat that's better than the floor. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. See, I'm gonna feel bad this whole video. She's She loves neglecting her child. Katie, me, I'm gonna feel really bad about it. But it's fun. We're having fun. It's, it's, a fu it's so funny. Can I turn the crying off, though? Is there, like, a crying slider in the volume menu that I can turn the crying off? Because I don't like it. I really hate the crying so much. Now we'll feed the baby. Now that we're done eating, we will go ahead and feed the baby. Oh, now she's asleep. Wake her up. <laughs> Now we have to wake her up to feed her. That's so mean. She's a really cute baby though. Okay, come work on your art. Sell this to a collector. You're doing really good. On the road to fame. Ooh, I'm gonna be famous. Oh, now I'm gonna put, okay, there you go. Now you're gonna put baby in the, no, don't kiss her. Don't show her any, don't show her any love. Ah, oh, too late. She already did it. Oh, I forgot to tell you too about uh, Tony. She dislikes every kind of conversation topic and she dislikes every single sims characteristic so she is completely she is a completely disagreeable human being there is absolutely nothing in this world that she likes well except for painting because now she likes painting <laughs> she's the worst person in the whole world and she's gonna raise the other worst person in the whole world poor tiny you're destined for nothing oh she's fine she could be hungrier she could be a lot hungrier honestly um, I think that Tony should feed herself first. She's the most important person. You know what they say when you're on an airplane? You gotta put the air, put the thingy on yourself before you put it on your kids. It's the same thing about breakfast. Feed yourself before you feed your kids. First blowout. Aw, oh, man. Oh, she didn't even clean up. Is that because she's lazy? Is she never gonna clean up her dishes? I don't think I've ever had a lazy sim. But that's me. I do that. I leave my dishes where they're sat. Oh, God, I'm a lazy sim. Wake up tiny so you can feed her. Bottle feed her, but do not change her diaper. It's very important. We're on a mission. I feel guilty. I thought this was going to be fun, and I feel really guilty. No, don't give her a bath. Oh, the welcome wagon is here. <laughs> Hi. Last time I saw these people, I de-aged and kidnapped them, which apparently was a messed up thing to do, according to the people in the comments of that video. Introduce yourself to your neighbors. Stop. Leave your baby alone. She has awful compatibility. She has awful compatibility with every person in existence ever because she hates everybody and everything. She's the worst. I can work on my aspiration a little bit. Yeah, just be awful to these people. Why are they still here? Why aren't they leaving? Fight, yeah, let's have our first fight. We've been alive for about 12 hours. I think it's time to get into a fight. Maso complete, ha <laughs> ha. Awesome, okay. I'm not gonna like complete her aspiration or anything. I was just kind of having fun with it. You know, I was just ignoring my baby and being mean to my neighbors. Oh, slept through the night. It's 8.45 p.m. How did you sleep through the night? Oh, I need to feed her. Oh, she refused to eat. She's having a big old tantrum. Okay, put the baby down and then go to bed. No, don't wake up. She's fine. She's not dying. It annoys me that they won't sleep through the night when the baby's crying. I want her to sleep through the night. There's a wall between us. You know what? I'll just cheat our meetup. I don't care. I'll cheat our meetup. We can do whatever we want. It's almost Tiny's birthday. Thank God. No, eat your salad. Oh my God. Infants are so annoying. Can I age her up? Do you think if I age her up now, she'll age up with the bad reward trait? Age her up. If she doesn't have the bad reward trait, I'm going to be so upset. I mean, I haven't, I didn't change her diaper once in her whole infanthood, so. Yeah, she did. Unhappy infant. Uh, what should I make her? Fussy? Yeah. 
Does she have makeup? What's on What's on her face? Is she wearing makeup? She is wearing makeup. Who allowed that to happen? No, no, no. Okay, I'll get her a toddler bed real quick. Uh, but I'm not gonna worry about giving her anything else because she doesn't need anything else. She's just, she just needs to be a miserable little toddler. She can go to sleep though. Now I want her to get all of these to be as low as possible, right? But other than that, there's nothing negative to get until she's um, a child because now they have like low self-esteem and high self-esteem. I'm gonna keep her as a toddler for probably like a day or two. You know, make sure she makes messes and yells and kicks things just to get her emotional control and her all that other stuff down. Okay, what kind of things can I do to get her to throw a fit? Yeah, throw a fit. Does your emotional control go down when you do that? It does, very fun. Be gross, belch. I'm just gonna get her to belch and fart over and over again. Belch, belch, belch. <laughs> fart, fart, fart. This is the silliest thing I've ever done in this game. I say that a lot though, to be fair. This is called speed running. This is called grinding. This is actually very serious gameplay. Oh my God. So, I mean, that's pretty good. We're already like a quarter of the way there. Now let's throw a fit. No, she's fine. Don't worry about her. Come do a painting. Throw a big fit. Oh, oh, she's so tired. Wow, that, all that burping and farting really took it out of her. Yeah, go back to sleep. Okay. It says hitting stuffed animals will lower our empathy. So I'm gonna get one of these and just, oh, I can't hit it yet. When can I hit it? At what level? Can she yell at her mom? Whoa, where are, where did you go? Why did you? I have no, I was not paying attention to her and I have no idea where she went. Her emotional control needs to go down. Okay, throwing fits makes the emotional control go down. But then it makes mom want to, like, do something with her. I don't want mom to react to me having fits. I just want to have fits. Oh, I can have her make a mess. Make a mess. Make as many messes as you can. Paint a mural on our beautiful wood floors. What happens if I yell at her? Does yelling at her make her more responsible or less responsible? Oh, it does make her more responsible. Shoot! I thought maybe if being, like, be, being mean would, like, counteract, but that's not how it works, apparently. Okay, my bad. Oh, her responsibility is not going down fast enough. Look at all these messes we're making! I cheated her communication level up to three so I can hit the- so I can hit this guy. Hit. 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 Can I be mean to my mom? Yeah, I should yell at her. That should be good. Mean. Malicious. Hit her? Hit her and yell at- No, don't put her in the- I just wanted to yell at her. Hit. Why are you picking me up? trying to hit you. Oh, she passed out. I didn't realize you were so tired. I'm sorry. I was having fun. There we go. My empathy did go down. Okay, you can go to sleep now. All right, everybody go to sleep at eight in the morning. Everybody's very tired at eight in the morning. I accidentally made you all nocturnal. That was my bad. Sorry. I'm gonna have her hit this thing so many times. I'm just gonna have her do this all day. I want to see how low I can get her empathy because so far our manners are low, but so far we're, we're not doing too hot. We need to get this stuff down. How is it? Oh yeah, it's oh, okay. Yeah, just keep hitting it. I've reached communication level five hitting this thing. That's amazing. I'm in a trance. I'm in a trance-like state. Oh my god, look! This is called speed running, baby! Oh, I did it! <laughs> Her empathy is all the way down. Yes! I'm so good at this! Now that's good. If I get like two of them in the, in the red before she's a kid, then I can work on, you know, all the other ones. All right, now I'm gonna have her be gross. She loves burping and farting so much. No, put me down. I'm busy burping and farting. So close. Yes, I did it. Maybe I'll have her make a couple more messes. Hit your mom. Hit your mom over and over again. Will that make your empathy go down or your emotional control go down? Oh, it's my emotional control. Okay. All right, I'm gonna age her up. I think I've done all I can. Um, should she be hot-headed? Maybe I'll make her hot-headed. Neutral conf- Okay, I have neutral confidence. Let's look at this. Sims with neutral confidence are still figuring out how they feel about their own capabilities. They can be easily encouraged or discouraged when gaining or losing confidence. A child sim's confidence level can increase or decrease depending on skill gain, school performance, positive and negative socialization, succeeding or failing, or skill-based activities. Confident or embarrassed moods and more. Caregivers criticizing or praising a child- Okay, this will be easy. We're never doing our schoolwork ever. <laughs> First of all, do you want to make enemies with your mom? While you're angry? Well, I guess you should probably go to bed. You're like very tired. Okay, take a shower so that we can start being evil together. Emotional control conflict resolution. How do we get your emotional control low? Let's yell at our mom. My confidence went up from yelling at my mom. What? Well, what can I do to make her shout at her? Argue about house rules. Will that make her confidence go down? Shout for been words, yes. Yeah. Rile her up. She is not angry enough. Make her mad. They do not like each other. This is so intense. Oh, family members with a difficult family dynamic will be mean to each other more often. The younger sim will less likely 
will be less likely to follow the rules or demands of the older sim and the younger sim will complain to the older sim more often. Uh, yeah, okay, sure, they can be, they can be difficult. Ask what Tony's problem is. Tiny has a fear of being inferior. Tiny is afraid that she will never measure up and struggles with confidence. When losing confidence, she will become tense. She will also become easily embarrassed when criticized or energized. Oh my god. Oh, can I criticize her? Criticize lack of social growth. Ha ha! Yes. As soon as she gets low with confidence, we'll age her up into a teenager. Oh, she's losing confidence. I can't. What if Tiny becomes a failure? What if everyone already thinks she is? Oh, man. This is so intense. Oh, no. My my responsibility went up because I washed dishes. No. Terrible. Bad job. Uh, make a mess. Oh, yeah. You can still make messes as a kid. Except her confidence is probably going to go up because I'm gaining the creativity skill. Oh, there's no winning. No, her confidence did go up because she went up a skill. No more making messes. Do you want to come, uh, shove your mom? <laughs> That's such an insane thing to do. Declare her your enemy. Declare your mom your enemy. That's so crazy. Woo! <laughs> Belittle anger. No, my confidence went up again. Confidence went up because I raised my social skill. That's what I get for talking to my mom. Can I, uh, criticize her again? Yeah, criticize her again. My confidence went down again. Okay, nice. Can I, how many times can I do that? Can I just keep doing it? No, I can't. Oh, I have school soon. That's good. Ooh, I should get her a dollhouse so she can destroy it. Smash it. Oh, no, not you. Fuck. No, not you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Your daughter. You smash it. I'll make you fix it after she smashes it so she can smash it again. Yeah, get its ass. Haha. -ha. No, her confidence went up. Why did your confidence go up from smushing something? I don't understand how that works. Her emotional control has not gone down fast enough at all. Come smash it again. Except for... Then your confidence goes up. Oh, maybe that was unrelated. Man, how many times am I gonna have to smush this thing? They make it difficult on purpose. No, don't. You're gonna raise your skill. Don't do anything that'll raise your skill. No, don't you smash it. For real, Tony. No, don't clean. Don't. Make a mess. She is trying so hard to be good. She's confident right now. Should I have her even go to school? What if she doesn't go? Maybe I'll have her go and do a bad job, right? Stop smashing. Okay, Tony, you're smashing it is like ridiculous. Stop. That's not for you to smash. It's for your daughter to smash. Okay, now she's losing confidence. And now there's an earthquake on our lot. Okay, casual, no big deal. So doing poorly in school, breaking curfew, or disobeying grounding. So can I ground Tony? She needs to do something bad for... Here, okay. I'll start doing parenting stuff to ground her. Where's that uh, family bulletin board? Let's get that. Set curfew for 7 p.m. And then we'll go out to the park past 7 p.m. Then we can meet some kids to fight with. Uh, should we go to the rec center? Okay, sit here and wait for kids to show up. But don't play. Let's just yell at some random adults. I guess they don't have to be kids. Rude introduction. Oh, yeah, rudely introduce yourself to everybody. Ah, yeah, that's good. No, why'd my confidence go up? I don't understand. Why does her confidence keep going up? This is too easy. I'm gonna have high I have high confidence? What did I do wrong? <laughs> my confidence goes up whenever I rudely introduce myself to a child. She loses confidence if she's embarrassed. How did she get embarrassed? I don't even know. Try to pick fight. I can't believe that she's got high confidence. I've been trying. Okay. Stop talking to these people. This is bad. This is not great. Uh, belch. Shout forbidden, fo shout forbidden words. Oh, that's just making my reputation go down. Okay, she's tense again. Okay, I'm not gonna let her gain any more skills because that's very good for her confidence. I'm just gonna let her belch and fart. No, her confidence is going up again. Oh my god, I'm- I can't. Come outside and sit on this bench by yourself. Curfew is about to start. If you don't come home soon, you will get in trouble. Okay, that's great. I would love to get in trouble. Her confidence is going up and up and up. Okay, no more spending time around children. That's a horrible mistake. Okay, it's our curfew. Breaks curfew. Sit. Yeah, break your curfew. No, why is your confidence going up from everything? I don't understand you. Responsibility is going down. Breaks curfew. Everything I do that breaks curfew brings my responsibility down. It's barely going down. This game wants you to win. This game doesn't want you to do a bad job. Okay, it's like nine. Should I go home? I'll have Tony uh, ground her so then we can break the grounding. That should be good. Oh, does my par do I have to have a higher parenting skill to ground her? I'm just gonna make it higher. Punish. Ground for breaking curfew. Here we go. Haha. -ha. Oh, uh. Let's do no TV. Ha ha, yes. And then can I say something mean about her confidence? All right. Why did my responsibility go up? I'm gonna come watch TV. Why is her confidence going up with everything that I do? I don't understand. I genuinely, I don't understand. No, now my responsibility is neutral. Oh my God, it's impossible. Oh no, you should pee yourself. Actually, I think that would be good. 
I think that would be really good for your confidence if you peed yourself. Have a quick, have a ham and cheese sandwich. Her confidence went up from eating. It's a lost cause. Okay, go to sleep. Good night. Your mom just broke your dollhouse. No, 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 pee yourself. You have to pee yourself. Go back to sleep. I'm not letting you use the toilet. Yes, she peed herself. Does that make her confidence go down? Go to sleep. I'm gonna make you, no. I'm gonna make you go to school. Dirty. If that doesn't make your confidence go down, then like I'm giving up. Pee yourself again, pee yourself again. I need you to be fresh, freshly embarrassed when you go to school. Okay, have fun at school. Good luck, slack off. Okay, we're back to neutral confidence. Yes, okay. I would just like to let it be known that it's almost impossible to have negative confidence. This is a, this game should be harder. Sometimes I wish this game was harder. Should I like leave school early? Skipping school results on bad grades. Yeah, I want bad grades. Who called me? The principal is calling. The principal is calling me? That's, shouldn't the principal be calling my mom? My principal called to say that my school performance is pretty shaky. If I'm not care careful, I could drop a grade. Yeah, I know. Good. Go to bed. Go to sleep. You have neutral confidence. I believe that we can make that confidence negative. I believe in us. This is going to be the hardest. This is our hardest, most difficult challenge. Also, responsibility. Oh, no. Don't get in the shower. I don't want that need to be high. I feel like that might make you more confident. You just go ahead and you sleep through the night. We have a big day of skipping school tomorrow. I want low confidence. Pee yourself, pee yourself, pee yourself. Oh, that does make your confidence go down. Oh, I have low confidence. Oh, I have low confidence. Oh, I cheated a little bit. Is that okay? I mean, this is a speed run. The buttons are there. <clears throat> okay, I'm aging up. Then we have your teenagehood to be extremely irresponsible and have bad conflict resolution. And what are the other ones? No emotional control. I think we're going to be mean like our mom. Tiny has earned a bonus trait. Low self-esteem. These sims become tense when they fail to gain skills or don't succeed in their career. They're also at a high risk of developing a fear of failure. Awesome. I love that for us. Oh, your hair. Hold on. This is dumb, but I literally have to change her hair. I don't want to- I hate that hair a lot. Uh, okay. Like mother, like daughter. I think I'm just gonna make her dislike everybody and everything. I don't want her to get along with anybody. There we go. The worst, the most distasteful sim imaginable. Wait, can I fight my mom? Your mom's- you're gonna make your mom pee herself. <laughs> Argue. Mocker. Throw drink. Oh, yes. Here we go. Mocker outfit. How are we doing? Conflict resolution. Can I fight her? Oh, she has a hurt sentiment. Oh, I've hurt her. I don't know why that made me sad. She's- I mean, she's a terrible mother. Ask what Tony's problem is. Haha, <laughs> mom just peed herself. Mom peed herself because you wouldn't stop yelling at her. That's amazing. Yell it, yell it, yell it, yell it. Insult, insult, insult. No, don't stop. Don't stop. Okay, my emotional control went down when I said something. Is it act tough? Shove? Is it shove? It is shove. I need to shove her. <laughs> this is- Oh, she threw a drink at me! That's fair. I deserve that. Shove her again. Just keep shoving her. Shove her in words. Yell at her. We're doing really good. Oh, she's scared of me. She should be. How many negative sentiments do we have at this point? This is so messed up. Oh, just five. Criticize, festering, grudge, hurt, grudging after a fight. I just gotta say, I don't think I should take this many shoves. I don't think it should take this much shouting and shoving to get your emotional control and your conflict resolution this down. This is insane. All right, well, we argued with our mom for about five hours, so that's pretty good. Maybe we should go to the recreation center and get into fights with more people. Rude introduction. Chew out. I want to fight someone. It wouldn't let me fight my mom. It might just be a coincidence, but Tiny can't shake the feeling that others are just constantly judging her. Is it her hair, personality, friends, whatever it is, Tiny is afraid that this won't be the end of it. It's your personality. Yeah, no, it's your personality. You suck. Mocker. The way that she won't get off the treadmill though. That's very funny. Oh, I despise her now. Can I declare her my enemy? Declare enemy. Yes. I can't fight her though. Is it because I'm a teenager? Can we not fight? Oh, my conflict resolution is so close. Oh, it's there. I did it. Okay. I'm going to come destroy this dollhouse. Come destroy it. Smash, smash, smash. I just need to like shove someone over and over again. It's like shoving is like the only thing. Oh, I have an idea. So that they don't have to keep fixing them for her to destroy them. Let's just put down like a bunch of dollhouses for her to destroy. If this doesn't do it, then I don't know what will. All right, destroy, destroy, destroy. Smash, 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 smash. Yes, the world is your playground, Twout Tiny. Everybody else is just living in it. Where's my emotional control at, by the way? It's so close! It takes destroying so many! I need more dollhouses to smash. It wasn't enough. This wasn't enough. More, 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 more. That has to be enough. Smash, 
Smash, smash, smash, smash, smash. Yes, oh my God, okay, we did it. That means that all we have left is responsibility, which is like not close at all. I'm really worried about it. We're gonna have to go to school for like three weeks and not do our homework once. Let's go home and take care of our needs. Oh wait, we should wait till after curfew. Yeah, let's just take care of our needs here. Tony, mind your business, Tony. I'll go, I'll come home when I'm good and ready to come home. Yes, my Ross responsibility is going down. I'm never going home. I'm never coming home, mom. Oh, I'm mortified. Oh, she's having a mood swing. Relatable. This poor girl, she's so miserable. Have more, have more coffee. It's okay if you pass out. You can sleep here. Yeah, okay, yeah, there you go. That may, that, I mean, that's equally as breaking the rules. No, don't, don't put stuff away. Come listen to loud music again. Gosh, you are impossible, Tiny. Uh, I guess we can go home now. We have school tomorrow to, we have school to skip tomorrow. Tiny lost her lost tooth. Girl, what? You finally lost your first tooth, Tiny, at 16 years old. I'm proud of you. Okay, well, I'm gonna send her alone because I'm just gonna make her come home. Leave school early. Yes. Prom is coming. She's not going to prom. Uh, what do we do all day? I don't even know what to do to make our responsibility go down any more than it already is. We're getting there, though. Oh, that was good. Oh, teens quitting their job. Teens quitting their job. Okay, so get a job. Find a job. Be a babysitter and now quit your job. Wait, I want to see how I want to see how fast it goes down, how far it goes down, to see if this is worth it. Um, I don't know. Let me do that like five more times and see if it feels like it's making a difference. <laughs> okay, find a job. Now quit your job. Wait, is she getting milestones every time she does this? Oh, look at her. Yeah, got a job, quit a job, got a job, quit a job. I don't think that that's affecting it very much. Let's keep doing it. Find a job. Quit job. Find a job. Quit. Find a job. Quit. Find a job. Quit. Find a job. <laughs> <laughs> quit 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 okay find a job quit all right how's it going how's her that barely did anything all right whatever how many we quit like seven jobs oh my god look at our look at our milestones she's so funny she's the funniest life i've ever seen she's lived a full and prosperous life all right, go to sleep. I'm tired of you. Then we can stay out all night past curfew. The Spice Festival. Yeah, let's go to the Spice Festival. Okay, let's come try the spicy curry challenge. Curfew is about to start. She wants to make an enemy. Let's, oh yeah, let's do that. Let's make an enemy. Who wants to be my enemy? This guy's doofy looking. Let's come make an enemy of this doofy looking guy. Scoff at discomfort. Shove him. God, I'm the worst in the world. Trash another sim. My mom. My, <laughs> trash your mom to this random stranger. Be like, and you know what else? My mom sucks. Whoa. He said, I understand your concern, ti Tiny. I'll chat with Tony soon. I would be lying if I said I wasn't nervous to approach her after that. Oh, wow. I turned this guy against my mom. Well, to be fair, my mom does also suck. I have declared an enemy. I have a horrible reputation too. Yes, I have an awful reputation. I love you, Tiny. You're everything I dreamed you would be. I'm like halfway there to my responsibility. Haggle, buy swag, e do everything that breaks your curfew. <laughs> buy chili powder, buy just like, uh, buy 15 chili powders. That's probably how many you need. Rude introduction to everybody. Everybody's your enemy. Tiny, everybody's your enemy. The festival will end in one hour. Well, what am I gonna do when that happens? I could go uh do a karaoke, is that where we are? Yeah, let's go do a karaoke. Honestly? She's not that bad. I'm gonna order a drink. That's pretty crazy. I wanna drink vodka at two in the morning as a 16 year old girl. Okay, I'll go, um, I'll go home now. Uh, take a shower and go to bed. Oh, it's New Year's. Oh, I don't have school today. Man, can I skip? Can it be, can I skip it? I want it to be Monday so I can skip school. Prom, oh, should I go to prom? Yeah, okay, let's go to prom. Oh wait, prom is over, I skipped the day. What happened, wait, what's gonna happen? Oh, it is prom. Let's take a tense photo. I love that, that's a beautiful picture. That's my favorite picture ever taken. You are so beautiful, Tiny, I love you. There's a werewolf rampaging at the prom. Really, guy? Well, it breaks my curfew to run away, so I guess that's what I'll do. Oh my God. They can't have prom because of this werewolf. Can you like go home? You're making everybody uncomfortable, dude. Whoa, what is this? Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, let's go to the after party. Let's ride all the rides. Let's just ride every ride. <gasps> Look how close I am to our responsibility. Oh my God. I just need to skip like one more day of school. Oh, it's spring. That's so nice. All right, let's go home. Look at all of my friends. Okay, all I have to do is skip school tomorrow and then I can age up and I'll have done it. Yes, this is so hard. I had to be so terrible and awful. I had to break 50 dollhouses. 
But it was all worth it. Okay, go to sleep. You have school to skip in the morning. You go to sleep too, Tony. I don't want to deal with you. I'm over you, Tony. She's angry. <laughs> she's so mad when she's around me. Unfinished business. Oh, man. Tiny, 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 tiny. Goodbye, have a good day at school. Leave school early. Oh my, yes! Bake yourself a cake. It's your birthday, birthday girl. You did it. I'm so proud of you. And blow out candles. Yay, happy birthday, my beloved. Okay, what? Oh, popular. She wants to be a friend of the world. She wants to be everybody's friend. <laughs> because she's so easy to get along with. Do you know what? I think she's erratic. Yeah. Let's look at our traits. Oh my god, we have so many traits. We are irresponsible, bad neighbors, unhappy infant, insensitive, argumentative, uncontrolled emotions, low self-esteem, and we're afraid of the dark and we're afraid of being judged. Good job. You are the worst sim possible in the world. That's it. <laughs> I love her so much. Wait, I have to save her to my gallery. Wait, I have to, I don't care about her mom. Get rid of her mom. Her mom means nothing to me. I'm saving Tiny, Tiny the Unconquerable. I'm saving her to my library because, listen, I love her. She means so much to me. If you have any ideas of what I can do with a sim with every negative reward trait, um, let me know in the comments because I'm very excited to have her. I just don't know what to do with her. This was so much fun and I just, I love her. So thank you for watching. I hope you liked that video. If you did, leave a like, a comment, subscribe. Um, if you like Sims content, that's what we do here. And that is all. So have a beautiful day and I love you and I'll see you all later. Goodbye.